This is Noelle, also known as Noe, Mama Noe, or just plain Mama. Mama Noelle came to Lovable literally by the happy wag of her tail. Pregnant and huge, she was scheduled to be euthanized days before giving birth, simply because there are too many of her. With the syringe ready to go, Mama's excited tail wagging and big grin convinced the vet that he couldn't do it. Mama Noe and her puppy stories are one of many, and one of many reasons why Lovable, in its 12 years of operation, is seeing some new and exciting changes. Last year, um, we were able to expand lab greatly. We went from adopting out just over 50 dogs in 2009 to in 2010, we adopted out over 150 dogs. A $25,000 grant from the Heigl Foundation now provides a quarantine, an intake building, a maternity ward, and various additions to the main kennel, keeping the spread of disease and unintended vet bills at bay. It's an expansion that supports the increasing trend of successful adoptions at Lovable. Two or three weekends ago, we had three pit bulls adopted, and we had a whole litter of pit bull puppies that were able to find homes. One of the reasons might be because the dogs here at Lovable put up a strong fight against a stereotype of the vicious pit bull. We take a lot of small breed dogs and we take a lot of pit bulls, and both those populations are, are just really abundant in the shelters in California. The reason we aren't in the maternity ward right now is because we have this little dog in labor. and She was actually scheduled to be euthanized and would have been if Lovable hadn't agreed to take her. Another mama saved thanks especially to the advent of Lab's new and improved facilities. It's been really exciting and really fun to see how much Lab has grown. Day. It's not just great to see how many dogs, but to see the populations living you know, in a healthy way. Securing Lovable's place in the race to save lives. She just got right in the, in the box. <laughs> Oh, As for Mama Noe, she's now taking care of an orphan litter of puppies at Lovable that she happily treats as her very own. And hopefully soon, she'll be smiling and wagging in the loving arms of new owners in a home that she so deserves. It's okay, Mama. Okay. In Eugene, Kelsey Card, 432 News.